have been commandeered uh, by His Excellency uh, uh, Chief Olusha Gmobasanjo to make this speech on his behalf and on my own behalf. So I do not take responsibility for anything that I will say. <laughs> he's, he, he's the one who will take responsibility for everything. So let me first uh, begin by saying that it's a very deep honor uh, to be here. And I speak, I'm sure, for all of us who are here to celebrate the life and times of uh, Papa Abraham Deary, who, as uh, we all know, was an exemplary teacher, a public servant, a lay reader of the Anglican Church, and a community leader. I think that uh, President Jonathan said it all when he mentioned uh, the array of individuals, ladies and gentlemen, who are here to celebrate the late Pa Dewey. When he was teaching here in Sampu, and I believe that he also taught in the Ekerema local government, in Oboto Bay, the former Delta State, and so many other places where he taught and impacted lives, and brought up the children of so many, nurturing the promises and aspirations of thousands of young men and women. He certainly didn't know that the day would come, I'm sure if he had been asked, that how did he think his death would be celebrated? He would have thought it would be a very humble one, at least many years ago. He certainly could never have imagined that the whole of Nigeria would be gathered here to celebrate him. But that is a lesson that we learn from scripture. The Bible says that in all labor there is profit. Proverbs 14 verse 23. In all labor there is profit. All the labors, all the labors, decent, honest labor, doing the right things as a teacher and as a mentor to many. The reward came not just in his son becoming governor, but look at the array of individuals today who celebrates this humble teacher and this man who brought up so many. So we bless the Lord for his life. We bless the Lord for the testimony of such a great life. And we thank God that we have examples of people like him who did the right things, who served their communities well, who are church men, in his own case, a lay reader, a community leader, built men and women up and we pray that the almighty god will console the entire family who have lost such a great individual so on behalf of the federal government of nigeria and the people of nigeria and on behalf of chief olusha Mobasanjo, gcfr and all of us who are present here today i'd like to express our sincere condolence to my dear brother, His Excellency Senator Duyo Diri, uh, Governor of Bayelsa State, his, his wife, Her Excellency, and all members of the Diri family. We express our sincere condolence and we pray that the Almighty God will comfort you and strengthen you. We believe that this is a great celebration and we thank the Lord that you are all witnesses to this celebration. God bless you all. Thank you.